This is video number one in the series. I'm going to teach you how to use Rank Builder NEO to get maximum results. First, we need to take a look at the configuration options. Before we do that, we need to go ahead and start the software. So I'll simply double click it. Then I'm going to receive a pop up box that's going to ask me to insert my username and password. I'm going to insert my username, password, and then simply click log in. Okay, we're going to go ahead and click on the options button. Over here, we have three tabs that we need to take a look at. The first tab is the CAPTCHA settings tab. Basically, what this option allows us to do is to outsource the CAPTCHA to somebody else. We have a couple of CAPTCHA websites here. If you have an account with one of these websites, then you can go ahead and insert your username and password, or in this case, an API key. These websites are going to automatically solve the CAPTCHAs once the software starts submitting to websites. You can also choose to do this manually. However, we highly recommend using one of these websites to get the maximum effects from Rank Builder NEO to get the maximum results by using Rank Builder NEO. In our case, we're going to use deathbycaptcha.com. There's also an option to check the balance of your account. I'm going to go ahead and click check the balance. This is my balance with deathbycaptcha.com. Once I'm done, I would just click save. However, before you do that, let's go ahead and take a look at the second tab, which is the proxy tab. The proxy tab is easy to use. All you need to do is enable it and then insert the IP address, the port, and username and password if you have a proxy list. So do go ahead and paste it in here. Then go ahead and click save and Rank Builder NEO will use this proxy list. Finally, the third tab in the options is the general tab. Over here, we have a couple of options that I need to explain. First, we have the max thread. This is the number of threads that you want to use in the software. We don't recommend using more than 30 threads because the software might become unstable if you go ahead and use more than 30. Basically, the more threads you use, the faster the submission and registration process will be. We recommend going with about 15 threads to get the best results and the fastest submissions. Next, we have the max auto retry. This is the number of auto retry submission and registrations to failed sites. Basically, if one site has failed, then Rank Builder NEO is going to go ahead and try a couple more times so that the software might actually succeed to register on that site the second or the third time if it hasn't succeeded the first time. We recommend using three maximum auto retries for best results. Usually, if the site fails three times, then it's useless to try again and again because there is something wrong with the website. Three auto retries is the best number for this. Next, we have the timeout. The timeout is connected with the auto retry. It represents the number of seconds and how long we should wait for our sites to complete before it moves to the next site. Basically, if a site does not complete the submission, then we're going to wait 60 seconds. And if the submission is not done, then the software is going to move to the next one. 60 seconds is a good number and I recommend the number so I'm going to leave this at 60. Finally, we have the delay verification. This can allow us to set a delay in the email of verification. It doesn't really matter what this is, just make sure it stays at 2 minutes because we receive the best results by going with 2 minutes here. The last one is to run the program automatically when Windows starts. If you want to use scheduling, which is tiered linking, we're going to talk about that later on, then you want to enable this. I'm going to leave it enabled because I'm going to use scheduling in the rest of this video. You can always come back and change these options once you understand what scheduling is. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and click save. This is all you need to know about configuring Rank Builder NEO.